it's Carleen. Welcome back to my channel, your source for all things style, beauty, and motivation. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a product demo. That's what you're about to see. I applied this makeup look using two new drugstore products. The first product was this Nivea Men's Pull Shave Balm in the Sensitive Formula. You guys have all seen this already. It's all the rave on YouTube, and I decided why not give it a shot since so many people have had good positive reactions to it. I really, really enjoyed this. You'll see that in the video, I rubbed it in all the way until it got tacky, and I think it worked just like a normal primer would. My makeup really stuck to it, and right now, like, my face feels nice and just, like, tout, and everything is just nice and set in place. So I really think it, it's a primer. It's it's a primer, it acts like a primer. So thank you to Nikki Tutorials for schooling us on that. The great thing about this is that you get way more for way less than you would a typical primer. I purchased mine at Walmart for like $5 and some change and you'll pay a couple more dollars for it if you purchase it at like uh, a drugstore like CVS, Walgreens, Rite Aid. So I would say check out either Target or Walmart first. It applies clear, it, it felt really nice. Uh, my skin is not irritated. So we'll see how this wears throughout the day. And the next product that I demoed was the Airspun Loose Face Powder. This also cost me $5 and some change and I purchased this at Walmart as well. You can find this either in the makeup section or the nail supply section. So where they have all the nail polishes and things like that. My Walmart had the powder in both sections so if you don't see what you're looking for in the makeup section check out the nail section because it might be there I got this in the translucent extra coverage and um, I think this is an awesome setting powder I'm really happy with my purchase now as far as the extra coverage claim I sometimes have really dark under eye circles because I'm not getting enough sleep nowadays so I really don't feel like it gave me any extra coverage but I do feel like this set my makeup in place and set my under eye concealer perfectly. So I'm really happy with this and you'll see how it applies in this video. The only thing about this is that although it says that it's uh, translucent, it does have like a rose tinge to it. So because of that, I had to combine it with my LA Colors Pressed Powder in Tan because this powder, the Airspun, has a like a rose tinge to it. Um, so I wanted a more yellow tinge to my under eye powder so I mixed it with this one because this LA Colors powder um, has a yellow tinge to it. This powder comes with like a really fluffy cute um, puff and this is great for the all over the face but as far as the under eye I actually had to go in with a thinner sponge the one that came with my other powder and if you guys have been watching me for a while you know that I love to use a sponge to set my under eye concealer because I do have a lot of creasing just because of the way my eyes are so whenever I put concealer on I have to go in with a sponge like this because I feel like it really just locks that concealer in place you may or may not get use out of the puff that comes in here stay tuned because I am going to be doing these products up next <music>
So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully it was helpful to you. If you found it helpful and you'd like me to do more whenever I purchase drugstore products or any products really, give this video a thumbs up so that I know. And also, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. What are you waiting for? Whenever I post a new video, you will be updated. So subscribe for more. Also, just wanted to let you guys know, I do have another channel called Le Mom Life. And that is the channel where I kind of share my new mom experience. I post everything from reviews to vlogs. So if you're interested, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also check out the link. The link will be in the description box. I upload on this channel every single Friday and I'll probably be uploading on Le Mom Life kind of with a similar schedule. So you'll get at least two videos from me every week. So make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out. And I'll see you in another one. Bye.